Yo, what is up everybody? This is Young CEO and this is a team deathmatch on downturn. And I'm running with the MP7 uh, Gold Extended Mags. This is my favorite gun in the game so far, man. Favorite, favorite, favorite. Uh, I have used, I pressed these once and I've used the unlock gear to keep this thing around. Um, you don't keep it gold and you don't keep it with everything on it unlocked, but you do keep it in your early stages to where you don't have to wait. Because I think this gun is like level 74 unlocked. You do not have to wait until that level. You do have the gun with you. Um, so what I wanted to do today, man, is I wanted to bring a, a little bit of tips from what I've seen so far. Um, as far as some of the game modes, since I'm playing de uh, Team Deathmatch, I'm going to give a little bit of what I know about Team Deathmatch. Um, the key to me is to really, uh, the mini-map, is always to check where your teammates are and to to anticipate where the enemy is going to be. So, if you look right now on the mini-map, my teammates are all behind me. So, I'm thinking their spawn is over there. They're moving their way towards us. There's a number of ways on this game where they can move now. Uh, in here, I'm moving with my teammate. And right now, he gets shot. I turn. I see this guy. Bam. I'm running away. I get shot. Get turned on. That NASA style. Get turned on real quick. Um, but yeah, so it's it's important to be looking at the map, looking at your teammates, and just getting a feel for where the enemies are going to be. If you get a feel for the maps, then you definitely get a feel for all the avenues, the alleys, the back ways that the enemy can come to attack you. Like right now, up here. Boom. Get him. Come on. Right now, I'm trying to push into the spawn, but now we're spawning here. So I know on the other side, towards that care package... Bam, see, they, they got to be going that way. So it's like, you just really anticipate where you think the enemy is going to be spawning at um, in relativity to where you and your teammates are. And if you're running with a team, you know, it's, it's, uh, it's a little bit easier to anticipate because your team might move with a purpose. When you're running, running with randoms, then they don't really move with a purpose. They're just moving to move. Especially if you're playing with people that are new. Like, well, the game's still new to everybody, but, you know, some people have kind of picked up the maps already. Some people have not, you know, and it's just going to be like that. It's going to be uh, months into the game. You're still going to see people moving around the map like they don't know what they're doing. So, this guy's going to jump down. Get him real quick. Get my Reaper. Uh, thank you for that. That was an easy kill. The Reaper is a good kill streak. Uh, if you've seen me use it before in my other videos, it's a very good kill streak. But on this map right here, it's not too good. Right now, I'm just looking for a spot to use it. And I also think that the enemies are going to be over here. So let's lay down, pull out that laptop. I uh, wish I was pulling out the Boost Mobile Phone, man. I, I like the Boost Mobile Phone, even though it's a little bit slow. But uh, I I'll go with the laptop too, man. It's in HD this year. So uh, it, it could be used. But um, like I said, see, they're all in the buildings. They could be underground in the subway tunnels. You don't know. So the Reaper and the AC-130, not too good. But like I said, the Boost Mobile uh, kill streaks, the one that you don't control, helicopter, pave low, those will go around the map doing work. So on this map, I would suggest to run a class that has those because I only have two kills in the Reaper. And the Reaper is beast, so... Alright, but I'm out the Reaper. I'm running up here, knowing that the enemy's gonna be here. Plus, I got a UAV, which is another important thing about running Team Deathmatch and running with the team. Is someone running the kill streak that you need? Um, UAV, counter UAV, things like that. You need to have designated people to do those things. I just feel like this game was made. Ah, uh, I got you, teammate. I got you. I got you. Oh man, no, I don't. But I get my jogger nut. I'm sorry about that teammate. It's all good. One of us had to survive. Uh, you shouldn't have been rushing in there. <laughs> right now, I'm just looking for a spot to drop this jogger nut. Man, this is the offensive jogger nut on the salt package. If you haven't used it, it is very beastly. He's going to be running around with the M60 and uh, a pistol, a revolver for his secondary. Very slow, but uh, it's just a tank class, man. You move. You move slow, but look at this. You've got the armor of a juggernaut. You got the M60. It's hard for guys to try to kill you. Really, they can only kill you if they're spamming grenades at you, sticky with a sticky, or they all just come up and shoot their bullets at you. Come on! Uh, get turned on, man. Get turned on and hit fired. 
You too, sit down. In the final stand. I'm the juggernaut, bitch. You didn't know? <laughs> oh, now I'm using that revolver. Let's go. He takes forever to reload, but it's okay. Um, just back up, do what you gotta do. You're in the juggernaut armor, so. Um, he's using scavenger like I said, so he's picking up more bullets, so you're not gonna run out You can stay in this thing as long as they kill you. This guy tried to throw a throwing knife at me. Can you believe that? A throwing knife? I'm the juggernaut, bitch! A throwing knife don't work? Come on, man. Act like you know. Act like you know what's going on right now, please. But yeah, man. And then, you know, they have constant intel of where the juggernaut is on the map. Uh, if you've used the uh, support... Get turned on! If you've used the support juggernaut or the offensive juggernaut, you know, they have intel where you're at at all times to show you on the mini-map. So you're a moving target, but it doesn't matter because you're wearing this armor. So as you see in there, you can turn on people like it's nothing. Shoot that M60, pull out that revolver. It's nothing, man. But yeah, back to the tips, man. Uh, running with a team, make sure people are designated to run certain things. I mean, everybody can't be running the... The, um, assault package and not a UAV. Everybody can't be starting with the Predator missile. Everybody can't be uh, UAV Superman on the team. Everybody can't be uh, MJ. Everybody can't be Kobe. You know what I'm saying? You just can't do that. Some people have to play the point guard role. Some people have to play the center position. Everybody's got to play their role to bring the team together. So I mean, it's best to run with a team. This game was suited for that. That's why they have the support package. Um, right here, I'm just getting eaten up by bullets, but it doesn't matter. Because I'm the drummer nut, bitch. <laughs> That's funny. I was in the lobby, and somebody got the... The riot show juggernaut. He stole it from a care package, and after the match, that's all he kept saying. I'm the juggernaut, bitch. I'm the juggernaut, bitch. It was fun as hell. But uh, this video is wrapping up, man. Uh, we won the game 75-34. I ended up going 24-0. and Giving you guys a little bit of tips to what I do. But uh, much more coming in the future, man. Um, so stay tuned. Until the next video, guys. Be easy. Peace.